Man. What happened, man? What happened? What I do, man? What I do? <coughs> <coughs> That's how I sound my daughter for the cry. That's when she crank up. She's like cranking up like a car. <coughs> That's how I feel, man. I don't know what happened, Sheldon. I don't know what happened, man. Well, anyway, what's going on, everybody? Uh, Sunday morning. Hope everybody having a blessed day today, man. You feel me? Um, I've been meaning to talk about this. It ain't really even nothing to talk about. It's just why. It's plain and simple. You feel me? I lost 3,000 of y'all. It probably went y'all. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what explanation it is. I lost 3,000 subscribers, man. I was finna hit the, I was finna hit the 300K. I was at 299, 500 something. You know what I'm saying? I was like 500 away from 300K. I don't know what happened, Sean. I don't know what happened. I tried to Google it. I tried to look it up. Why would you lose this amount of subscribers? I heard people... I say before you can lose why are youtube say well if you notice your subscribe subscriber count going down it's because we're getting rid of spam spam accounts or something like that people that's not real people or whatever i have no idea man um i don't and, I, and i've also heard if it's like no if somebody don't watch your videos like no activity they don't interact with your videos leave comments likes and watch your videos they're unsubscribed too so i don't know it just seemed like as soon as i'm about to hit 300k they take three. I ain't never lost this many. Well, I, don't, I sometimes I don't pay attention to my subscriber count, so I could have lost. I could have lost three thousand before and not known it. But three thousand subscribers, three, three thousand subscribers, gone. You know what I'm saying? But I can't say if it's if it if it was spam accounts or people that weren't watching or something like that. I can't really get mad at that because I mean that was just empty subscribers. It's, at that point, it's just a number. You know what I'm saying? And it ain't people that's engaging and watching the video, man. And I make the video for y'all, man. I make the video for y'all, but 3,000 subscribers, I was almost there. I was almost 300K. I started getting away. I started getting together my giveaways and stuff like that, what I'm going to do for 3, uh, 300,000 uh, subscribers. But it's all good because it's still coming, man. But it, I'm talking about it cut straight. I had 299.5. Mm. So I didn't really use, I lose three thousand. I lost like twenty five hundred, cause it cut straight to two hundred and ninety seven thousand, straight to two hundred and ninety seven. Boom! And one day, and I woke up and I was looking at my phone. And said, my wife was sitting by me. I said, babe, I lost like almost three thousand subscribers. She said, what? I said, yeah, I'm back at two ninety seven. I was almost at three hundred k. I'm back at two ninety seven. She was like, what happened? I said, I have no idea. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know. Y'all comment below. Tell me why y'all think. Uh, YouTube would just take 3,000 of my subscribers for, for no reason. Well, I, like I said, I guess it's the spam account. I don't, damn, I don't even know what the hell a spam account is. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know what, what a fake subscriber. I, I, I even heard you could buy subs. Somebody told me you could buy subs. I'm like, why? Would, it's going to show that. that if, it's going to show that you ain't got that many subs. Like, if you buy subs, and, you, and only a small percentage of your subscribers going to watch your videos anyway. Because if 100% of people subscribe to my um, channel, watch my videos, I would average about 250, you know, to 280,000 views per video if everybody watched them. You know what I'm saying? I average probably about 20,000. Average. Sometimes it's more, sometimes it's less. But it's going gonna, it's gonna to always be around 20, 25, maybe 30,000. That's out of 290 something thousand subscribers. So, um, I don't know. People subscribe to your channel and then they um, they grow out of your content. They don't want to watch like sneaker stuff no more. And I don't even always want to do sneaker videos because I know it's like other stuff people might be interested in. I just got to find out that that even um, I got to find out that even uh, uh, content that that both you know that that'll bring more people in, but still. Um, still it'd be good content for my loyal subscriber. You feel me? So you know what I'm saying. We'll we'll see how we gonna do that. I was gonna go live about this, but I don't have. I literally don't have uh, time to really figure out. I still ain't figured out all the live stuff yet. So I'm still I'm still gonna do that, man. That's coming. I was gonna do a live for my 300k 
like celebration now we're gonna be drinking and the family and t wood and hopefully everybody's gonna be able to have you know kind of like do a little celebration thing we'll see how that's gonna work whenever i get to 300k at this point but um yeah i decided to do this little video i'm on, I'm on the way on the way to pick my daughter up so uh i decided to just do the little video and ask why man you feel me why did i lose 3,000 subscribers i'm actually not really mad at all <laughs> i mean it ain't like i don't care but I, i'm i'm not mad at all about it it is what it is um i get them back it ain't no i mean even if i mean it's y'all were supporting me regardless man so i always appreciate the support i just when i first saw it it hit me it hit me kind of like different i was like i just lose three thousand what happened you know what i'm saying because i i mean and i think it could have happened before like i said i don't i guess i don't pay attention to it until i'm almost at the milestone stay i'm almost at 100k almost at 200k they ain't never happened in those two times but close i get to 300k they they drop me down or maybe it's the it's end of the year get close to the end of the year they want to weed out all the bs accounts i guess i don't know but anyway i done talked y'all head out long enough man just want to make a quick video and put it up as soon as i get back to the house and um, I do have an unboxing coming later on today. Uh, top 10, oh, top 10 sneakers gonna be hard, boy. Top 10 sneakers gonna be hard, man. Cause I gotta go back through everything I bought this year and I guarantee you I'm gonna leave something out, man. I guarantee you I'm gonna like, damn, oh yeah, I forgot I copped those. And there's gonna be people in the comment, like, Rich, you went crazy over this shoe. Why didn't you put this in the top 10, man? Are oh, you cap? But it's gonna be hard to, like, man, I gotta like go through, the only way I'm gonna be able to re remember every shoe I bought this year, I'm gonna have to go through like my videos. I'm gonna have to go through my archives or, or, or IG posts because I usually post everything I get. But I didn't, there's nothing about it. I didn't post every shoe I got this year. And a lot of videos I put up, I didn't put the shoe in the thumbnail. So I'm gonna have to click on the videos and watch through it to see what the hell I caught. <laughs> Gotta be like, I can't believe I bought these or, or I got these, uh, you know what I'm saying? Just kind of leave the suspense so y'all don't know what shoe it is. I did that on a lot of videos. So I'm gonna have to like really think. I bought so many shoes this year that I'm gonna have to really think about every shoe that I bought this year, man. Cause I can't think, I mean, it's gonna be stuff that I wanna put in that top 10 that's, that I bought in February. You know what I'm saying? That I, that I don't remember, I don't even remember copying because I don't have it out on display. You know, like most of my good stuff I do have out on display um, in the cases behind me, but it's a lot of shoes that's still in boxes that I didn't, like in the last couple of months that I bought. So anyway, I don't know, man. Y'all, if y'all got a good way that I can remember every shoe, oh shit! I probably should just go through the sneaker releases. That's gonna take a minute too. If I go through one of those websites that that put up post sneaker releases and see what everything that came out was for each month and just pick it out and just, I can just write it down. I don't know something like that probably work. That probably work better than trying to go through my videos and seeing what I caught, um, seeing what actually released on release dates. So y'all come below and tell me if y'all got any um advice on how to do this top ten. I appreciate y'all for watching. Everybody who is subscribed, I appreciate you. If they happen to unsubscribe you for some reason, just go ahead and do me a favor and check or uh, make sure you're still subscribed. If you're not, go ahead and hit that subscribe button again. And if you want to see my videos, I don't put up number like two or three videos a week. So if you want to make sure you catch my videos, go ahead and hit that notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation, man. Shout out to Rich Nation. Everybody who subscribed to me is Rich Nation. Even if you watch my videos and not, I prefer that you watch them, but y'all rich nation, man, stand all the way up to the moon on them, man. So, do all that good stuff, and um, I'm out of here, man. Keep watching my videos, and that's what I'm here for. Go Why, man? <laughs> Mike, rich, no hype, just kicks, Jordan.